checking on the stream here. Doing all right. The connection is excellent, which is always good. Let's go ahead and check our boxes. And we are going to make Peter. Now, Peter was called by Jesus when he was a fisherman. And he says, Jesus says, I'm going to make you a fisher of men. So Jesus likes puns. I don't know if that translates perfectly in, uh, in Aramaic or uh, Greek, which the Bible was originally written in, at least the New Testament. Aramaic, was it written in Aramaic? I don't know. Uh, what was it? I'm going to Google that right now. What language was the Gospels written in? That's bad English, but you know what? Uh, all. Greek. Uh, with an Aramaic source text for portions of the New Testament. Ah, because they spoke Aramaic at the time. <laughs> cool. Learning and knowledge. Fun. Let's go ahead and make him a human. Surprise, surprise. Uh, and let's see. Hmm. We, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go with uh, the very first just regular standard human. And this should be interesting. Uh, language, what language should he speak? I don't know. Oh, that's a great question. Uh, let's see who Rome was in charge at the at the time. Uh, and so, uh, I don't know, Salamic. That's like a higher power sort of thing, right? Uh, magic people overlooking Knights of Salami. I don't know. Okay, what did I what did I put down? He is going to be a fighter because he is very quick to jump into action. He's kind of a hothead and uh, cuts a dude's ear clean off and Jesus is like, hey, d oh, wow, don't do that. Um, for the background, I'm going to choose Fisher, another one that I just unlocked recently. And he gets another language. Fun. Uh, let's... <clears throat> he doesn't need uh, Celestial because he, he talks to Jesus directly. Um, I don't know. That sounds kind of Islamic. It's Estar, Estarian. That sounds Islamic. So, history and survival. So, he's he's going to be able to, uh, to fish. Harvest the water. Cool. Um, let's go ahead give him some abilities he gets a plus one and everything from being a human and i don't like odd numbers so let's try our best to to even this out let's just go ahead and start with a bunch of 11s across the board and then we'll go ahead and adjust from there really giving you a peek behind the scenes in my process uh let's see and then let's see if we can bump strength up we have nine points to give away so this will be interesting uh, hmm. Put a 13 there, and maybe he has some, some initiative, and so we'll bump that to 13. Uh, we have five points left. Uh, I'm not liking the way this is going. Okay, uh, I'll give him a 15 in strength, and we have one point left over. You know what? I'm just. Do I want to leave it there? Ah. Uh, Ah, I don't like this. I don't like it at all. I'm just going to leave the point there, even though that <laughs> that is going to bug me. Um, all right. Uh, let's go ahead and give him a fighting style. He is a duelist and some proficiencies. Uh, let's go with athletics and let's see, perception. Because he, he's on a boat, so he can, he can get some sailor type of stuff. All right, and we are going to then give him an archetype. He's going to be a samurai so that he can get advantage on cutting people's ears off. Uh, let's give him a skill. 
we'll give him persuasion because he does persuade a lot of people to believe in Jesus and uh, yeah I guess fighting spirits let's see does he need to go over here? yeah yeah okay yeah we'll make make him level seven so that he can uh, be very elegant with his speech okay let's go ahead and bump his strength strength and ooh, I hear more cooking strength strength all right and that should put us at 20 for our boy Peter yeah okay cool 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 I don't like this one I don't like it I don't like it what if we did this and then we did this and then we'll bump that up to eight to get this ability score improvement feet and athletes yeah increased dexterity sure climbing the boat stuff uh running up to slash people or running away i don't know who knows ah, okay this is the first one that i've had some struggle with but hey we ended up with all even numbers that is good and uh oh man okay I'm actually going to, to swap these. He's going to be more charismatic. Yeah, that makes more sense. Okay. Peter. Fisher man. Peter. Peter, Peter, Peter. Pumpkin eater. Hmm. <laughs> I kind of like that guy. I think I'm going to save that for the next one, though. Well, maybe this guy's Peter. <laughs> I am pretty content with that. I think that is going to be good. Yeah, I'm going to leave that there. There's Peter. He's like, hey, let me get my sword out and slash a dude's ear off. He's known for a lot more than that. He also uh, is like, hey, it's cool to eat pigs now. Bacon for everyone. Let's give him a long sword to slash a dude's ear off. And we'll give him two hand axes. What the heck? And he'll explore around. And uh, let's see. Yeah, he'll, he'll hold on to his favorite fishing lure. Cool, cool, cool. Give him his shield. Hey, he has a net. He's going to be a fisher of men. Fisher of people. All right, that is going to be it for Peter. He is our uh, human fighter, jumping into action. Got a solid plus two to initiative. Going to be slashing dude's ears off one-handed. And uh, eventually he gets crucified upside down. Because he's dramatic and he's like, don't crucify me in the same way as Jesus. All right, that is going to be it for Peter, our fisherman. Man, fisher. Claim that. And that will be number eight. Our final build is going to be Paul, who is formerly known as Saul. But not really. Stay tuned. I'll explain that. Mm -hmm.